You're watching Expert Insights. I get the question a lot of times about income growth. Income growth is now 18 years old, and what should we expect in the future? Uh, and the answer really is simple. It's more of the same. It's a combination of very strong uh, dividend payers, uh, some of the best quality companies in Canada. The great thing about the Income Growth Fund is it's a great diversifier for a portfolio of either individual large cap dividend payers or another uh, dividend focused fund, which most likely is going to be focused in on large cap Canada and large cap global stocks. We, we focus in on small mid caps and the reason is, is because there are so many more companies that we have to choose from uh, in order to create a portfolio of the metrics that we like to see. And those metrics tend to be faster growth, better free cash flow yields, a higher dividend yield, higher dividend growth rates, but at a less expensive price. This fund is a great complement to the NCM Dividend Champions Fund. Alex can concentrate more on small and medium cap companies, which is a good complement and contrast to some of the larger dividend champions that I've invested in. The great thing about this fund is that you can use it both as a wealth creation strategy and a income supplement strategy. Uh, it's been a four bagger over the uh, period that the fund has been around. Some investors use it as an income supplement strategy where they take the dividend to supplement their income and then the capital itself has still been able to grow within that scenario. It took 18 years for Alex to deliver an 18 year track record. And I know I'm sounding cheeky when I say that, but there are very few mutual funds left in Canada with the same manager, the same mandate, the same history. And that's a real testament to Alex. That's a real testament to NCM. And more importantly, that's a testament to the investment mandate of owning high quality dividend paying companies in Canada.